The Tetis is a phase of every individual's life when things change drastically. You might have heard stories of certain men in the past generations who learned and eventually rose to become great after their 30s. However, in this era we are in, anyone who seeks to live a fulfilled life must fasten his or her seatbelt before he or she clocks 30. Number 1. How to beneficially make use of money in your 20s, your greatest desire would have been to work and save enough to acquire sophisticated gadgets or a sports car or exquisite vacations. Nevertheless, as you approach 30, your aspirations ought to change from just working and earning to minding your own business as Robert Kiyosaki puts it. Before you turn 30, you must be financially literate. Your focus should move from just building a house to building a firm. Setting up goals is necessary, but a goal without a plan is just a mere wish. For you to map out suitable money plans, you must learn the rudiments of money such as saving, budgeting, being debt-free, insurance and policies, taxes and most importantly, making profitable investments. Number 2. Making the right friends in your early 20s, your primary concern might have been to be accepted into just any circle of individuals. However, before you finish your 20s, you must change that mentality. You must understand that you don't have to be friends with just anybody. You don't have to be the life of the party and you don't have to be accepted in just any social group. All you need are people who can be of positive influence in your life. Besides. It will be best if you always remembered that no matter what happens, family comes first. Families fight, families hurt one another. But never abandon your family members for anyone. Before you turn 30, you must learn to forgive those who hurt you. You must also keep in touch with members of your family and you must never forget to bless your parents. Number 3 learn from your mistakes just maybe you played the blame game in your 20s feeling bad and sulking each time you made a silly mistake nonetheless before you turn 30 you must realize that from every situation especially your mistakes there is always something to learn failing at something does not make you a failure instead it brings you a step closer to greater success if you learn from it and try again the success gained from the lessons learned from failure is much greater because you acquired a depth of knowledge that initially success would not have taught you. You must move from beyond blaming yourself into accepting your faults, learning from them, loving yourself still and moving ahead. Number 4. There is no shortcuts to success, you only need to work. Successful people who seem to be doing no work were once hard workers who have gotten to the point where their money works for them. In this age, you must know the importance of hard work and integrity and the need to partake in the process. Many people presume that smart work is better than hard work, but the truth is that there is no legit way of working smart that does not involve hard work. Number 5. The outcome of your life is based on your own decision. Most people spend their 20s passing blame games on the government for not providing jobs, on parents for forcing them into career paths that they never intended to be in, even on the society for not appreciating their dreams and on the educational system for not teaching financial intelligence and other things needed for survival in the outside world. However, for you to be successful in life, you must halt that attitude before you turn 30. You must consider at all times that you are responsible for your present position in life and only you can move out of that position. Think and grow rich. Number 6. It's not everything you learn from school. Peradventure you depend merely on what you learned from school and was too lazy to seek solutions in your late 20s. Before your 30th birthday, you should realize that your school did not teach you everything needed for you to survive in the real world. Hence, you have to search for additional knowledge and act on them. 
As witty as it may sound, the fact remains that not everyone is destined to have a degree. Often, many people waste their twenties applying to various institutions, switching courses and trying all they can to bag a degree. The worst happens when the same attitude is carried to their thirties. Formal education is not for everyone. Therefore, the school is not the problem. You are the problem. You must look inward to determine what your motivation and aspirations are in life carefully. The 30s is a time where you invest in yourself and your dreams. You could register for necessary courses to equip yourself and acquire relevant skills that are essential to pursue your dreams, but you must not formally graduate from school. Number 7. Work out your destiny. Research shows that over 52% of the American population believes in faith and destiny. Well, relying on destiny and trusting faith is not wrong. However, believing that your destiny will work itself out no matter what you do or fail to do is a pitfall you do not want to be in. William Shakespeare once quoted that, It is not in the stars to hold our destinies, but in ourselves. We are the molders of our destinies. So if you assumed that things would somehow fall in place during your 20s, you must stop thinking that way before your 30s. Because the statement, what will be will be, is not correct. What ought to be will not be if you do not do what you ought to do. This is the reason why American essayist and poet Ralph Waldo Emerson once said, the only person you are destined to become is the person you decide to be. Number 8. Learn to collaborate. Life is a battle and a constant struggle. However, it is not an independent race. It is best described as an independent journey in which rather than compete, you collaborate. The only person you ought to compete with in life is you of yesterday. Before turning 30, learn that not everyone will be there for you at all times because everyone else has their struggles. Sometimes, life will knock you down. You must not wait for someone to help you up, and you have to find that inner strength in you. Stand up, dust yourself, and keep moving. Face life squarely, and seek for people who are interested in what you do to collaborate with. Number 9. Not everyone is supposed to like you. One of the biggest mistakes you can ever make in your 30s is trying to please everyone or attempting to be loyal to every big boss. You can respect everyone, but never try to be loyal to everyone simply because you want to be loved by all. Seeking to run around everyone only gives you a petty image before everyone. Margaret Thatcher said, If you set out to be liked, you would be prepared to compromise on anything at any time, and you would achieve nothing. It is a difficult thing to think about, but you must realize that not everyone likes you, and that's okay because not everyone is meant to like you. Moreover, no matter how many people like you, it does not matter if you don't love yourself. In your 30s, you ought to have gotten to the point where you channel all the energy you use in worrying about people that don't like you into liking yourself and being your best.